be with you. Welcome back to my channel for another video, another spiritual download. If this is the first time that you're coming across my channel, I just want to greet you by saying, hey there, hi there, and hello there. You're more than welcome to like this video, share it, subscribe, comment, maybe send it to somebody at your church or maybe call the pastor and say, hey, you know, we're watching an oracle <laughs> on our smart TV. Would you like to come over? Listen, whatever you decide to do, I absolutely do support you in the energy. Come on in here, get this spiritual work. You know why? Because nine times out of 10, if you're really sitting with your higher self asking spirit to give you some type of clarity and or confirmation, there's a 99.9% .9 chance that spirit guided you here for that confirmation. It's up to you though, right? To discern what's for you and what's not for you. Just leave it for somebody else to take. I always say, lay it down easy. Leave it on the table. Leave that for somebody else to pick up. Nevertheless, if you're returning back to the channel, then you are my beautiful, beautiful, amazing, gorgeous, blessings upon blessings, high vibrational, high frequency, soul tribe. Soul tribe, I love you. I love you so much. Soul tribe. I know you felt it. I know you caught it. I know you got it. I know you love it. I know you love it. Yeah, I know you love it. I can feel it. I can feel the love. I thank y'all for your love and support, your love donations, your beautiful prayers. Some of y'all pray for me and I thank you and I pray for you. Listen, I got candles at my altar that just say soul tribe. Like all my known and unknown soul tribe. Like even if I don't know your name directly, baby, there is a prayer in the ethers for you. There's a prayer that went up for you as above, so below. And when the prayers go up, the blessings absolutely will come down. So all we got to do is just keep our hands open and be ready to receive. That's it. It's so easy. It's so simple. Peace that surpasses all understanding, I just heard. But listen, let's go ahead and get into the spiritual download. I've already called in my appropriate protection. I think I do that all day, y'all. I just talk to my angels all day. I stay in prayer constantly. <laughs> like, I've already called it my appropriate protection. Hell, I was doing that last night in the ethers. Nevertheless, let's be dignified here in spiritual court. This case is interesting. You know, I don't know what's going to come out. I just, I got like the preliminary of it. I'm just going to let spirit use me by way of my gift. Holy Spirit, beautiful divine providence, the God above all gods, creator of all things. Gaia, I just heard Gaia keep us grounded. Keep me grounded, Gaia, as I channel this energy by way of balance. Equilibrium, I just heard. Okay, some of you are really getting in balance by way of the physical and or spirit. Thank you, thank you. So listen, I call upon my divine angels that have been rocking and rolling with me all my lifetimes. I call upon my war angels to war with anything that tries to come up against the divine plan for my life and or the divine plan for the collective's life and those that they love. Put a shield of protection, impenetrable shield of protection around the beautiful divine collective. Protect their feet as they go about their path, walking in their birthrights. Thank you, creator. I ask that the truth be exposed in this spiritual case. Holy Spirit, beautiful divine providence. Please allow me the ability to uncloak any energies. I dedicate these cards to you. They must tell me the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. So help us, most high God. We've all been sworn in. That's what that was. You know that, right? In spiritual court. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, you better be about that spiritual work. I heard somebody was trying to sabotage your life, but they won't get far. Okay. Well, you know, show me what I need to see. Archangel Michael, please and thank you. As these cards tell me the truth. Who are these people, places, and things? Somebody that betrayed you. Somebody you moved away from. There's a mother figure that is watching you, okay? Yeah, there's a mother figure that's watching you. This is interesting. Yeah, she's watching her child with a gift. Page of Pentacles is good news about money, but this is giving me page, child with a gift. My child has a gift. I know and I've always known that you are a star, okay? But somebody tried to sabotage your life and I heard they won't get far. So I don't know why her energy is coming up. Page of Pentacles, again, also represents 
stability. There's duality here, but the page is giving me child with a gift that has a victory. Somebody's watching you get a victory. Somebody really can see you clear as day. Whoever this mother is, she's very clairvoyant, queen of cups. Okay, very psychic, giving me high priestess energy. And um, yeah, I just heard dominion over the earth. I don't know why I heard that. Two of wands, this person could be at a distance missing you. Somebody's watching you in the public eye. You could be a star. You could be a celebrity. You could be somebody that is um, in this celebrity vibration by way of what it is that you're creating. Okay. Yeah. High priestess. Somebody's watching you in the public eye. Somebody's having bouts of nostalgia flashing back. I just heard I remember now. Okay. I don't know if this person mentally checked out, spiritually checked out, or what happened, but there's a mother saying, I remember now. Okay. Why is that here? Why am I getting this energy? Why am I getting this energy? High priestess energy. Going within energy. Virgo energy. Piscean energy. Yeah, listen. Somebody is watching you be a better version of them than they could be. Maybe I feel I'm getting like dream deferred energy. What, what this person wasn't able to do, you're able to accomplish. This person is saying, I always knew you were my child with a gift. You are my special spiritual child. You could be one of maybe three children, four children. Okay, something of that nature. Yeah, the hermit is here. Something about going within, following your instincts, high priestess energy, intuition. The devil represents desires, okay? And this particular spread, this Capricorn energy is giving me somebody that is desiring something, a victory, a child with a gift, a star. Yeah, ace of pentacles, like a gift from above. This is how this parent sees you as a gift, from above, somebody's saying you are the empress. You are the empress. Why is this tower here? Because I heard sabotage and somebody won't get far. The tower represents eliminating falsehood. Like literally the, the veil has been removed. So whatever was unseen is now being seen. I'm also getting like somebody's handing down their spiritual gifts to you. Okay. Why is that here? Justice is here. Somebody's really spazzing out over the fact that things are being balanced out. Justice is here. This is divine intervention. Like I'm getting God walks with you. The most high walks with you. I am your own. This is what, this is what, Somebody is saying to the divine, I am your own. I am, you know me by name. You know my name. What's that song, that gospel song? You know my name. Yeah, you know my name. Something about the book of life. Something about something being written. Something about uh, something being ordained and or orchestrated by the ancestors for you to inherit something uh, that I feel that your foremothers were not able to do, or maybe they only got so far, right? And somebody checked out and somebody's saying, oh, I remember now. Whatever this generational curse is, you broke it. Whatever it is, okay? I just heard that every woman in your family gets to a certain point, Okay. And, and they're not able to go any further. Like they check out. Like this is giving me some type of generational curse over the women. I don't know why I got that. But whatever this entity is, whatever this issue is, whatever this uh, demonic force that comes for the women in the family. Okay. Somebody could come from, um, uh, have people in their family with Alzheimer's. Right. Right. That's a smoting of the mind. That's somebody that 
you know, uh, doesn't want to remember. And also it, it, it reminds me of somebody that's ready to go, ready to check out, you know, kind of like the timelines and the signals get crossed mentally. Right. So something about not remembering, but somebody saying, oh, I remember now. So this could be an older woman. OK. Maybe in the early stages of dementia is what I'm getting. Whoever this person is, um, somebody had a very traumatic life. It's giving me post-trauma, tough childhood. Somebody got to a certain age where they just really wanted to forget it. And see, this is how smart the mind is. Now you go, you know, Western medicine says, oh, this is Alzheimer's, this is dementia. By way of metaphysics and spiritual, you know, uh, diagnosis, if you will, and people always like to say, well, I'm not a doctor. Yeah, I'm not a doctor. I've not been to medical school, but baby, I've been to the ethers. Now, let me tell you what I know about metaphysics and the mind. You know, when the mind goes, the body is ready to go. So somebody could be just kind of uh, deliberating and or contemplating their mortality. Somebody's saying, oh, I remember now my child with a gift. Yeah, the tower is here. There's been this huge revelation, okay, about who you are and somebody is remembering something that they did to you. Like I'm getting somebody in and out. I'm getting somebody that's, um, you know, they know, but they forget. Somebody's in and out here. Something came for somebody at a certain age and I feel like it could have very well came for you. It's like it, I'm getting my mother's 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 mother, right? And you're the only one that's been able to overcome this. This could also represent mental illness, okay? Depression, you know? You hear people say, oh, my mother suffered from depression and anxiety. And oh, she was in a mental hospital. Like, and my mother's 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 mother. That's a curse. Like, what? That's not a noble thing to do. My mama's 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 mama. Well, listen, the curse stops here. This is what I'm getting. The buck stops here, Okay, whatever this entity was that keeps coming for the mental health at a certain age, I'm hearing 39, 40, something about the age of 40. The buck stops here. You're the only one that has had a victory over whatever this entity is. I'm getting it's a spirit problem. This is a deeply rooted generational curse. And you've been victorious. This person says, oh, I remember now. Somebody's remembering a spiritual contract that they have with you. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Listen, whoever this person is, they could have betrayed you. They could have sacrificed you to the devil. Somebody checked out at a certain age and couldn't remember. And I'm going to be honest with you. 39, 40. I'm getting 40. Okay. Okay. They could have wanted to admit this person into a mental hospital. Said, okay, they're crazy. They're this, they're that. Whatever this is. Whatever this entity was, it absolutely did come for this person, this mother and her mother and her mother and her mother. I'm just getting mother's mother. And then the buck stops here. They didn't get far. Whatever this energy is, okay, it didn't get far. Somebody saying, oh, I remember. Show me what I need to see. Somebody's, somebody's awakening. By way of your awakening, you're awakening yeah. Oh, I remember. Somebody saying you are the highest in the bloodline. Nobody's ever gotten this far. Woo. No pressure. No pressure. I mean, you know. Yeah, no pressure on this one here. Somebody saying, I remember. Somebody's scared. I'm getting fear. I'm getting fear of judgment. I'm getting fear of uh, somebody possibly, again, checking out. I don't know what this means. Did something take hold of this person, control this person? They did something. Somebody sacrificed their starseed child to the devil. And justice is here. But something used this mother Show me what I need to see. Yeah, death is here. I can't make it up. This person's thinking about their mortality. Ten of Pentacles gives me family, gives me lineage. Yeah, the helping hand of the most high gives me spiritual gifts. Okay, something about a victory, a starseed child getting a victory. 
you are the high priestess because you went within and you conquered some type of demon deeply rooted in your DNA on both sides of your family. Going back since the beginning of time. No pressure, Starseed. No pressure, Lord. Yeah. Two. Somebody is going back and forth trying to balance out their mind. Two of Pentacles is giving me back and forth energy. Somebody doesn't know how you did it. Nobody's ever been able to do it. Show me what I need to see. Why am I getting this energy? Yeah, nine of pentacles. It's been a long time coming. This bloodline like, was like under some type of curse. Okay? Yeah, where maybe all the women in the family, you know, went through something. I don't know. I'm getting, yeah, something like 39, nine of wands. I'm getting weight. Yeah. The ancestors are celebrating you. I can't make it up. <laughs> I just heard, I'm so proud of you. Before I even looked at the bottom of the deck, I love it when the truth precedes the cards. Thank you, Divine Providence, just for giving me this gift to see. Thank you, Gaia, for keeping me balanced in my physical body. It is work to channel this energy, y'all. Like, for real. To be chosen to do it, just to feel that energy move through you and you can physically feel... What people are going through, this person's heart is uh, releasing some type of bitterness. Whoever this mother is, yeah, she was trapped. I felt like she was trapped within herself. You know, she was always there in the background, but something here took control and came for this person at a certain age. At a certain time, you know, there was some type of offering. She sacrificed her child to the devil, but it didn't work, okay? You're coming up as the Hierophant, the Seven of Wands. Yeah, you're the leader. And for energy, all because you have faith to go in the right direction and follow your destiny, your destined path. You released a lot of resentment. Anger, guilt towards people, honestly, you know, that didn't deserve it. Honestly, they did some malicious things. But you understand by way of the larger scheme of things, why things had to turn out this way. Show me what I need to see. What's going on? This, this is some really intense energy. I've been channeling real intense energies lately. Yeah, temperance is here. You're an earth angel. Oh, my left ear is ringing. Here we go. This person's in their last days. Okay, my left ear is ringing. High pitch. This person is saying to you, I gift all of my gifts. You are most deserving. Even after the betrayal, you understood why it had to happen this way. The world is here. Something's coming to an end. Something's coming to a close. Literally an end here with the death, the betrayal. Somebody's saying, oh, I remember what I did now. Temperance is here. Okay. That's giving me angel, Archangel Michael energy. Somebody wants to apologize. Could be a water sign and fire sign air sign this is like a family deal but this mother why is my left ear ringing please and thank you angels what is it that we need to know in the situation toil and labor somebody was working really really hard to do something this also represents somebody just fighting to live or to get back into your good graces somebody's sick like mentally physically i don't know what i'm getting yo god a lover Okay, you got a mother, you got a lover here. You got people that are watching you stand in your power. Leo, energy, strength is here. Yeah, why is that lover's card here, Archangel Michael? Ten of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. I'm getting... 
I just heard a mother and her son. Okay, so you could be a masculine. There's also a lover here that wants to get a message through. Gosh, it's really coming through powerfully. Like, I'm like, which download to take, spirit? You guys are watching me go through an ascension on screen. Like, I'm sitting here like, what? What is this? The lovers, okay? Somebody knows that you have options in love, that you're in this Ten of Pentacles energy. This also represents gifts for me and also represents um, family, okay? Toil and labor. Why is that toil and labor here? Show us the truth, Archangel Michael, please and thank you. What is this about? Oh, I just heard they're doing it all for clout. Somebody's out here doing something for clout. Your mother's watching everything. She's saying, I remember now. I don't know why I keep getting that. But somebody tried to sabotage your life. I think it's this ex-lover, Five of Wands, fighting off of these, you know, fighting off, excuse me, these choices. Somebody knows that you have multiple choices in business, money. Yeah, stability, Ace of Wands, a new beginning. Somebody is working really, really hard for that not to come in for you. And you're getting new gifts. Like this person can't stop what you got coming in. Somebody's really working hard though. Who is this person? Like they just came into the reading, but I heard they won't get far. Yeah, somebody wants to, you know, stop this new union. You have something new coming in by new love. Somebody is, yeah, it's a failed attempt. What is going on? Somebody is won't get far. And I feel like whatever this is, okay, this mother figure could have done something that they're ashamed of because they're saying, I remember now. I just keep hearing that. You are my starseed child, strength, power. Yeah, somebody's in the five of pentacles. Somebody's feeling left out in the cold. This could be this lover, okay, whoever this is. Somebody feels as though something's not fair. So there's a mother here and an ex-lover. I just heard my, mo my mother, mother and a son. This could be a son-in-law, okay? Maybe you're a feminine. Or this could be a mother and her son. I feel like this is an ex-lover and your mother. Maybe this person is calling your mother. You know, I want this person or this is her son. I'm getting yes, yes, and yes. Somebody is like, that's my son. <laughs> okay, well, you marry your son then. Because <laughs> somebody is gone. <laughs> okay, that was just an unnecessary commercial break. Are commercial breaks ever unnecessary? Yeah, something is backfiring, y'all. Yeah, listen, eight of pentacles in reverse. This is work that was done over your life, over something. Something is like, you went within. You're loving on self. You're looking really good doing it. Somebody's really afraid of that because they know that this is going to yield you getting a beautiful life. When you go within, you don't have to go without, without prosperity, without peace, without pure love. Like you're going within all the while, somebody wanted to blind you from the truth of something, not a source, is air energy. This is giving me courage. Somebody coming at you, moving forward is what it's giving me. And somebody is really in deep regret, okay? Earlier this morning, I absolutely did hear some birds crying again. Ah, ah. It just reminds me of people being tortured by something that they've done that they either can't forgive themselves for or they can't receive forgiveness from the creator or they want your forgiveness or somebody just feels like the forgiveness has to come from you all the while this mother is saying this is my star show me this mother how are they connected the chariot cancer energy why is that here okay yeah the fool somebody's mom birthday could be in june okay that's for somebody in particular by way of this being a queen of cups. The fool. This person is, is talking about taking a leap of faith, moving forward, Cancerian energy. Why is that here though? 
Why is that here, Archangel Michael? What does that mean? I know who you are. I remember. What does this mean? What is this mother saying? She's saying, I remember who I am and who you are. Somebody's passing you down some type of generational blessing uh, by way of rites of passage, initiation, gifts. This is what I'm getting. The ancestors are really celebrating this energy. Show me what I need to see, please, and thank you. Yeah, you're the empress. You're being crowned. Ooh, wee. You're going through a ceremony in the spirit realm by way of being crowned the empress of all empresses. Something about something was divinely orchestrated and or prophesied that you would come at this time in your lineage. I just heard to claim your throne, to take your crown. Who we? Whoever this person is, King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is a heavy on a Sagittarius. I don't know what happened, but somebody wants to reconcile equal give and take. They're fighting off anybody that tries to come near this empress. What is this about? Somebody's doing magic. Two of Cups. They're desiring you. You are the high priestess. They know that you know the truth. And somebody really needs this to work out. But there's a tower here. This mother. What? How is this significant? A lover and a mother? Like, what do they want? Yeah, Eight of Wands is Sagittarius energy. The Tower is Scorpionic energy. Something's being made clear. Show me. I don't even know what to say, Spirit, because these people is all they're just all over the place. Show me, show me mom. Show me mom. Show me what mom has to say. Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Stand in your own power. Something about being independent. Okay. Queen of Pentacles is also a wife. Five of Swords is somebody fighting. Okay. So somebody could be fighting this lover. Wow. Why is that here? Archangel Michael, show me what I need to see. Yeah. Sagittarius again. Temperance is clarifying temperance. So you got a mother figure. That is like awakening from some type of trance or whatever the heck this was that had her in this nine of swords energy. I remember who you are. You are my child with a gift. Watching you grow, watching you glow, watching you take your throne, watching you be the hierophant, watching you be the empress, watching you break this huge generational curse by way of some type of entity that has come for every woman in your family and you demolished it and you put the entity on its back. This is an old, ancient spirit, something that's been attacking the lineage for lifetimes. I'm getting somebody did witchcraft like over a thousand years ago, literally over your lineage. And it was prophesied that something would be broken and or destroyed. And here you are. Voila. You have taken your throne, taken your crown. Rightfully so. And then in that you have somebody that knows that you are now at this rank. They have a spiritual contract with you, okay? Whoever this lover is, they are absolutely somewhere, somewhere, excuse me, possibly dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, and or a Capricorn. This could be a Sagittarius. Take what resonates. Gabriel is blowing the horn. Judgment is here. Show me what I need to see. Yeah, baby. Infidelity. Somebody's cheating. Somebody is like, I don't know what this is. It just came out of nowhere. Three of Cups. Somebody's fighting over you and you're not even around. But somebody has to get to you. Somebody believes that somebody is with you. They're in some type of argument with a partner. OK, this could be right now because my ear just rang like it's like ring the alarm. I mean, no, no, no. I'll be damned if I see another showing you on. This is what this person is saying. Somebody's fighting at a distance. Why is the three of cups here? Archangel Michael, please. And thank you. It's like you're going through this initiation, this rites of passage. You're in the ether celebrating. You like, why the hell are you all at my party? Like, take that fighting over there. And then you got a masculine, a whole divine masculine. That's like, I got a contract with you. 
I need to get away from her. I've already made it through this karmic cycle, but somebody is literally fighting. Somebody could be fighting. There's conflict at a distance. Who and what the what the heck is going on? Can we please have a commercial break? Show me this, these people. Who is this? What is this? Why is this? Somebody did magic. Somebody's manifesting you. And now somebody's under judgment. I can't make it up. This is crazy. The magician is here. Gemini energy. Somebody did magic over you or they're manifesting you. And now they're under judgment for not fulfilling some type of spiritual contract with you. And they're getting their ass whooped. Somebody needs to come in. This is what the ancestors are saying. Let me tell you why this is so vital by way of your mother's bloodline. Something's really powerful about your mother's bloodline. Okay. Maybe there was a curse of divorce, separation, single mothers. Those are generational curses. Something has been broken. I just heard it stops here with you. Okay. Whatever that is, something about this masculine and his bloodline by way of his father's bloodline. The ancestors are getting together in the ethers. Your ancestors and his ancestors are saying that this spiritual contract was supposed to be fulfilled. Why hasn't it happened? And somebody is doing their best to manifest you back in or somebody did magic over this union. Could be this person's wife, uh, this queen of pentacles, did some magic over maybe a union with, with this person getting with an empress. Could be a Libran, okay, fire sign or any sign. Let's just take the energy as it resonates. Virgo is also here. Judgment is here. Somebody's under judgment for not fulfilling some type of contract and they need to come in and make it right. And your mother is saying things are up for review. Oh, I remember now. But your mother tried to sacrifice you to the devil. She absolutely did. She absolutely did. Oh, we. She's saying, I remember now. I was fooled. I was tricked. I was bamboozled. Show me what I need to see, Archangel Michael. Four cups. Somebody's in heavy regret. Somebody's in heavy regret. Somebody doesn't know if they're going to make it on time. I just heard they won't get far. This person is fighting tooth and nail. Somebody's having a fight, conflict, argument about you. And I don't even think you're with this person. I don't even know if you know who this person is. It's a tower. Something is about to go down. If not today, something. The police could get called. King of Cups is at the bottom of the deck. Somebody has deep emotions for you. Ten of Pentacles. Wealth, abundance, four of swords. Spirit set somebody's ass down. Queen of Cups. Okay. Like what is going on? Somebody saying, I can no longer be away from you. Whoa, okay. Well, I don't even know what's going on. I think you're being initiated. You're like, I'm at my ceremony. I'm taking my throne. Like, what do you want? Real deal, Holyfield. For real. Ascended Master Energy, 3333. Better catch that synchronicity. Better get that spiritual work. You better catch this synchronicity. You better catch this spiritual work. Oh, commercial break. Commercial break. Commercial break. Commercial break. Hey, hey, I need a commercial break. Because listen, what the hell is going on? Whose story is this? And the bird outside my window is crying. Me, 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 please. Please, baby, 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 please. Lord have mercy. Archangel Michael, yeah. Piscean energy. Something about, why is that here? Somebody feels stuck. They're fighting. Their house is in chaos. There's a tower. Somebody just woke up to the fact that they're supposed to have a contract with you. Everybody's waking up. Your mama waking up. This lover's waking up. You're already somewhere. You didn't broke the generational curse. And maybe that's why everybody's waking up. I don't know. But you are the Hierophants. You could be somebody that's very spiritual. You could do spiritual work. You could be about that spiritual work. Mm -mm -mm. What else do I need to see? 
Anything else we need to know, angels? Yeah, Queen of Cups. Why is the Queen of Cups here? Somebody's in heavy love, deep love, passionate. Jesus, please get to this person. Somebody's in their head. Whoever this mother is, this mother saying, I remember now. She knows that she could have done something to try to block your love life, sacrifice you. Something that, that wanted this, like something that wanted this curse to continue. Whatever this thing is, this spirit issue, this, this energy that is attached to the bloodline or was attached, wanted you to be, I don't know, not in love or something affected this contract. So now somebody's under judgment. So not only is this lover crying out for help, this mother is crying out for help. I'm getting cause and effect. Somebody did something, okay, as above, so below, and really did not process the magnitude of the cause and effect by way of your destiny. But here's the beautiful thing about the divine. You are still getting your destiny fulfilled. If not with this contract, if not with this mother, you've already done the work. You are the high priestess and the hierophant. Somebody is saying you can't be touched. You can't be touched. Somebody is spazzing out, losing their mind. You got a, 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 a partner somewhere with a karmic that could have done magic over them. It's trying to bind them. But they're awakening. This magic can't be done as you broke the curse. You broke it for like your karmic, not your karmic, but this, what is this? Who was this? Your twin flame, soulmate. Like, I feel like anybody that shares the same soul as you, the curse has been broken. And so now here lies the tower. There's a veil that can never be put back over somebody's eyes. They can't go back to sleep after this. Like, it's impossible. Ace of Swords. This is like a domino effect. All because one person stood up and broke a curse. Ooh, wee, I remember now. You are the child. You are my star seed baby. You are the angel. Whoo, Lord. Oh, meanwhile, you slapped the hell out the devil. You walked right up to him and said, sit your ass down and slapped him right in the face, honey. Get out of my way with this ace of wands for I will whoop that ass with my right hand. The most High has given me power. Not only that, you could have walked away and left these people behind. And so this is really what's hard for them because they're kind of stuck with their past investments. These people were like asleep under some type of trance or trance or whatever this is. King of Wands is significant. This person saying, I got to get my reconciliation. But I honestly feel like there's several suitors. Somebody is really wanting to come in and give you equal give and take. I told you there's several people. This person is literally in the ethers fighting them off saying, I have a contract. I have a contract. I have a spiritual contract. Like what? How you? That's like somebody. Listen, can we just do another commercial break? That's like you standing at the altar. And they're saying, if anybody here, you know, thinks that these two people should not join together in holy matrimony and somebody runs into the church, the temple, wherever you're having your wedding on the beach and says, I don't want these people to be together. I got a contract. Somebody is saying, I have a spiritual contract with this person. And you turn around and you look like, did you really just run up all up in this ceremony? Now you show up. It's too, it's too late. Somebody knows it is too late. Mm-mm-mm, baby. Baby. <laughs> baby, 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 baby. <laughs> Somebody want to spin the block like Ashanti and Nelly, baby. Listen, something's been illuminated. It fell right on top of the nine of swords. Something has been made abundantly clear. And somebody, again, can't go back to sleep. And that's real. Now, whatever somebody thought was going on, they're going to have to come to the reality of what it actually is. And this is what's the hardest part for them. Yeah, nine of cups. What's the outcome in this situation? What do the angels want us to know? Yeah, you, you just walk into your, listen, I can't make it up. You got a new offer here, okay? Seven of cups is telling me you have options. That spirit was so gracious by way of your journey. You have options. You have different paths that you could take. You are being guided to leave some people out in the cold. You have a new contract, King of Cups. Somebody's coming in to love you the right way, baby. That is mirroring the same energy. By way of them being the Empress energy, by way of them being the higher font, these are two high vibrational uh, people that are whole people. Like I'm whole all by myself, but I'm a force when we're together. Listen, 
to the song here in my heart a melody la, 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 la. listen somebody's happy ten of pentacles you're reaping the benefits of all of what you've done and the ancestors are just giving you blessings upon blessings upon blessings they're celebrating you they're happy you're setting them free they're happy some of them couldn't go into the light they're going into the light yeah i just heard going to the light carolyn okay that might have been a little too deep for somebody but this is the message okay somebody tried to sabotage you spirit says they won't get far it's a thin line between love and hate somebody is hating the fact that they are with the wrong person seems like they're stuck Okay, there's conflict, there's fighting, there's, you know, this person's being accused of infidelity, three of cups, because somebody believes that they're wanting to be with you. You're nowhere around, but whoever this person is with, this lover, somebody thinks that they're with you. This could be a masculine, a feminine, take what resonates. Somebody is getting caught watching you, okay? Be this on Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, your gram, my gram, yes, ma'am, yes, sir. Listen, <laughs> somebody's out here watching, and somebody's lover either got their phone. It's like, oh my god, you're doing da 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 da. You caused a whole fight in a house that you're far, far away from. Like honestly, and whoever this mother is, this person is begging for some type of favorable judgment and death. Yeah, it's a tower. Something came for her. Something used her to separate her from her child her star seed child yeah this person this person was being tormented okay whatever whatever disease this was in the lineage whatever mental illness you know uh energy entity spirit problem i feel as though it attacked your family for a really long time but i keep hearing the buck stops here it won't get far somebody wanted to sabotage you somebody used your own mother whatever this somebody something is it used your own mother or at least it tried to and they're saying i remember now please forgive me yeah this person's not not going to be around much longer but we all know that the spirit doesn't die it just goes to another realm and dimension so please ask that this person get a favorable judgment in death is what they're asking okay as I open this door, I ask that the Most High close it, shut it. Anything that tried to come through a portal, please get your ass back in your portal and go back from whence you come. Nevertheless, this is the message. I love you. 4244, just as I said that, all my information is down below. Until the next video, as always, peace be with you.